Hi, I'm Susan Moore. I'm Deputy Director for San Diego County Library, and I chose A Lesson Before Dying by Ernest Gaines because I love his books. We pledged allegiance to the flag. The flag hung limp from a 10-foot bamboo pole in the corner of a white picket fence that surrounded the church. Beyond the flag, I could see smoke rising from the chimneys in the quarter and beyond the houses and chimneys, I could hear the tractors harvesting sugarcane in the fields. The sky was ashy gray and the air chilly for a sweater. I told the children to go inside and begin their Bible verses. After listening to one or two of the verses, I turned out the rest of them. I heard them all so many times. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. God created the heavens and the earth. Let not your heart be troubled. Believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house, there are many mansions. Jesus wept, and on and on and on. I had listened to them almost six years. I knew I would say what, just as I knew, what each child would wear to school and who would or who would not know his or her lesson. I knew too which of them would do something for themselves and which of them would, regardless of whatever I did. So each day I listened for a moment, then turned it off and planned the rest of the day. My classroom was the church. My classes ranged from primer to sixth grade, my pupils from six years to 13 and 14. My desk was a table, used as a collection table by the church on Sundays, and also used by the Church of the Holy Sacrament on the fourth Sunday of each month. My students' desks were the benches upon which their parents and grandparents sat during church meetings. The students either got down on their knees and used the benches as desks to write upon or used the backs of their books upon their laps to write out the assignments. Ventilation in the church was by way of four windows on either side and from the front and back doors. Our heat came up from the wood-burning stove to the center of the church.